What's up everybody? My name is Greg Miller with Negative Space. Today I'm going to show you how to use the hyperlapse with the DJI Mini 3 Pro. First thing we're going to want to do is get the drone in the air. Let's do that right now. It's a little windy out here today. Um, we'll see how it does. First thing you want to click on this little icon there and then scroll down to hyperlapse. And then, so you have a couple options. You can do free, circle, course lock, and waypoint. I like to use waypoint because it's very useful when you want to show the construction process of a building. And you will see what I mean by that. So the first thing we'll do, get up in the air. And right now I'm just probably gonna use two waypoints to keep the video short. But at the end of this, I will also show a full clip video of how this works or what you can do also. So we'll just uh, use this house right here go up a little bit more and we'll click on here set waypoint and so when you have your first angle which you want to show you just click on that first box and let's start let's do one right there and Let's do another one right there. And then let's do one more. Right there. All right, once you have all the angles that you want, you just want to hit the uh, little red button on the to the right side. The aircraft is heading to the first wave. And so it'll take 150 pictures in the last 5 minutes. So it'll go to the first starting point. And then it'll start shooting the pictures. So the reason why I like to use uh, hyperlapse and I like to choose the waypoint, it's not only can I set the direction of the drone where I wanted the drone to go, but I can also come back to that construction site another day and use the same waypoint that I used before. So for instance, if I go down to waypoint again and click on set waypoint, you can see that the boxes are empty. But if I click on this little page icon, you can see right here, this is today's. I can click on that. And if I hit the red button, hit the record button, then it'll go right to straight to that waypoint. So you can use that on any construction process, uh, construction site, or you can use it in the city. Some people like to use it in the city. But today I just wanted to show you how to use the hyperlapse. If you have any questions, please let me know. Thanks for watching.